Hey guys, it's me Minori. Welcome back to my channel. Hi. So guys, today I'm at Toys R Us. Oh, I love Toys R Us. Yes, Toys R Us in Japan is still open. And since it's almost Christmas, I'm here to do a big haul. No budget haul. I don't know when I'm going to be uploading this video, but today is December 7th. It's almost Christmas, guys. Christmas is my favorite season of the year. I'm so excited. I see a lot of cute stuff. Let's just get started, guys. No budget haul at Toys R Us. Let's go! Okay, so first off, I'm at the entrance and it's the Lego section. So many Legos. All the friends. Ooh. This is cute. I've always wanted to try this. The dots. Maybe one of this. Oh, it's already $70, guys. This is insane. But I do want to try this because I've been looking at this for a very long time. Moving on. And next, the Minecraft section. We've got some creepers, Minecraft stuff. And over here, Among Us. Yes! Aww. Saikuno. A pookie. That's so cute. But interesting. There's so many Among Us stuff now. There used to be like none. And this is like a figurine. We've got some more stuff. While they're great, they're just not my cup of tea. And I always say this, but whenever I go to a haul, I'm not gonna buy like random stuff that I don't need. I just like really, really cute stuff. A Nintendo Switch. And the gaming corner. Interesting. I've played with these before. Some board games. But I'm gonna need some friends to play these. A Pokemon crane game! I want this! But I know I don't need this because I already have a crane game at home. But I love Pokemon! Fun fact, I've been obsessed with Pokemon recently. So I think I'm gonna buy a lot of Pokemon stuff today. Ooh, poker! <gasps> I know this! I used to have this at home! You guys know this? Things flew out and you try to catch it with your net. Oh, memories. So nostalgic. Let's go over here, guys. We have some coloring bags. Sumiko Gurashi. Colored pencils, origami. Oh, <laughs> look at this. It's a fridge. But this could be like a cute desk organizer. You could put your pens inside. That'll be cute. Guys, these pencil cases are so adorable. Look, look. I used to use these when I was like 10. It looks so useful now. Hmm. Pokemon. Do I need any stationery? Oh, scissors. Maybe one scissors. Ooh, slime. Oh, they have instant snow? You can make your own slime here. So there's a lot of cute stuff here, but honestly, they're mostly for school. They're like stuff to use at school. For example, you know these shoes? In Japan, you need these extra shoes at school. And these are called uwabaki. So everything here is basically for school. Let's go to the toy section. My favorite section. And here we're at my favorite part of the store, the DIY section. Pokemon! Oh, oh, oh. So adorable. And oh my gosh, you can make like little homes for Pokemons. I've never seen these before. That's so cute. This is gonna be hard. What should I get? Ooh. This is kind of scary at the same time. I guess the eyes move. Really? Oh, that's so cute. Like a mini gacha machine. I want a box first. A kitty corn and a puppy corn. Maybe one of these. Oh wait, they have squishmallows here? I need squishmallows! Hmm, which one should I get? I've always wanted one of these. I know it's really popular in America, but I think it just came to Japan. It's my first time seeing these. I gotta get one of these. Hmm. Or this, or this, or... No, mm -hmm. This one's cute! Maybe this one. Maybe this. This is so cute. Okay, let's go with this. My first Squishmallow, guys. I kind of want more, but I'm going to stop myself right here. Yay, I didn't know that they had Squishmallows here. So happy. Okay. And here we found some more DIY stuff. Which one should I get? I've had this before. I've played with these before. I bought these. I bought that. I have that. I have that. What's this? A slime kit. I'm actually really interested with this. It's actually new and I've never played it before. Let's try this. More Pokemon! I'm ready to catch them all. I already have this. I have Pikachu. Which one do I not have? I have that. I have that. I don't think I have this. I have a lot actually. More Pokemon. 
Oh gosh, I'm just so happy looking at all these Pokemons. They're so cute. And this section is for like little boys. So here we see a lot of like action figures. These are called Urutorama. Some Toy Story dinosaurs. Again, not my cup of tea. But I mean, I love Toy Story. <laughs> this is, guys, this is interesting. We have a pet dog. It's all pink. I don't think I need some pearls. This kickboard's cute. A princess kickboard. I would have used this. I can't skateboard for life, guys. This is like the more athletic part. This is so cute! <laughs> I love the colors! But like again, I'm not gonna use it, so I'm not gonna get it. Um, I think I'm good with this section. And by the way, guys, if you go over there, that's the baby section. Babies are us. Hopefully, I can come back here like next year or maybe like the year after that. We'll see. But yeah, um, let's go back to the DIY section. And we're back at the DIY section. Okay, last shopping spree. Let's get everything. I've had this before. I've played with this before. I've had this before. <laughs> Ooh, this is new. I've never seen this before. A glitter heart shaker. Interesting. Okay, okay, okay. So one of this. I've unboxed that before. I've unboxed that before. I've had this before. I've had this before. <laughs> it's hard to find like something new. I've played with this before, but I want to show you guys because it's really interesting. And I think this is only in Japan. Okay, so one of this. Getting full, guys. What else? And by the way, guys, I highly recommend these if you guys want to draw. I think I'm going to walk around one more time. Guys, I was going to buy this one, but I decided to get this one instead. So I'm going to change my item. Just saying so you won't be surprised. Interesting. Okay, you're coming with me. There's one more thing that I really, really want. And it's going to be this way. And this is the Christmas tree section! Guys, I actually really want a Christmas tree. It's like my dream to have like a really big Christmas tree at home. Which one should I get, guys? I want like a really big one. So I want either this one, 250, but it's 30% off. Or this tree. And this is $100, but it's 20% off. So around $80. Which one should I get? Oh my gosh, this is so hard to choose. This one's taller, but that one has all the ornaments and stuff. Guys, can I ask my partner? I can't choose. And then you should go. Who is the best? $240 and $210. Okay, I just asked my partner and he wanted this one. So let's go with this tree. Yay, my first really big Christmas tree at home. My dream come true. Now that we're gonna get a tree, we need some ornaments. And this is what I found. Pikachu light. That's so cute. What else do they have? You know what guys? I'm actually gonna choose the ornaments with my partner because I can't choose this all by myself. Choosing. I think I'm gonna steal it from him. So guys, I think I'm finally done shopping. I chose my Christmas tree, and here are all the toys. Oh, I'm so excited to try out all these new items. It's definitely going to be really fun. Okay, now that I'm really satisfied, let's go back home to see what I got. 
And I'm back home. So here we've got two big bags of toys. Let's see what I got. Okay, first toy. So this is called Spring Good. Apparently you can make your own accessories like a bracelet, hair accessory, a key holder, and it's Sumiko Gurashi. It's super cute, one of the newer toys and I had to try it out. And this. This is like a dollhouse kit, but you can turn the dollhouse into like a shelf. I've played with this before. I had to get this one for you guys because it's just so interesting. I don't think I've ever seen something like this before outside of Japan. I just wanna show you guys these random interesting Japanese toys. So that's that. Next up, it's called my decorative sequin patch set. Okay, I don't think this is a Japanese toy, but it looks so fun and I've never played with anything like this before. You can make your own cute patches. Interesting. And <gasps> Lego! It's the dot set. Disney version. I've always wanted to try this out. So you can make like a Mickey Mouse shelf and decorate your stationaries with it. Ah, uh, this is gonna be fun. I've been wanting to play with this forever. So Lego set. Next, I've got two rainbow corns, a cat version and a doggy version. I've never opened these before, but I know they're like really, really popular. We'll see if I like it or not. And this is the last DIY toy that I got. And this is called a glitter heart shaker. It looks something like this. And you get to make your own keychains and accessories and stuff with glitter. Anything with glitter, I have to get. And next up, ta-da, Squishmallow. My very first Squishmallow ever. <laughs> it's so soft. I want to use this as my pillow. That's how soft it is. I know Squishmallows are really, really popular in the States, but it's still not that big in Japan yet. So I had to get two for myself to see the hype. It was my first time seeing these at the toy store, and I wouldn't be surprised to see more in the future. I love like the watercolor like effect. It looks so pretty. So yeah, guys, my very first Squishmallows. And we're almost done. And lastly, here's all the random small stuff. For example, I got some scissors. I got a little Pokemon. And I've got three prizes from the Sanrio vending machine. My sweet piano, Pachaco, and this is a pouch. Oh, it feels like a Squishmallow. <laughs> it's so soft. It's like a really squishy pouch. <laughs> Ta-da! And here's all the stuff that I got today. Oh wait, I lied. There's actually one more item. There's actually one more thing that I got. And I got a Christmas tree. In total, it is around $500. But I mean, the Christmas tree costs the most. Anyways, I'm going to unbox some on my other channel. I'm going to unbox some on this channel. And today, I want to unbox a few things. Which one should I choose? Hmm. Okay, I'm going to go with these three today. Two rainbow corns and one DIY toy. So, let's start with these two. So first off, the puppy one. Peel and reveal magic heart. Hmm. <laughs> The reveal, three, two, ooh. So we got this dog with wings and there's more inside. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. Her name is Shorty. We've got some stickers and there's like this egg inside. I wonder what this is supposed to be. Okay, so it's like a little crystal dog. Oh, these are called Boo Boo Corn. Boo Boo Corn Puppies. It has like a hole in the butt and you can put it on your pencil. So a cute stationary thing and it comes with slime. Ooh, it's like a jelly slime. Uh. <laughs> and they call this the magic puppy poop. I wouldn't be mad with this poop. To be honest, I like playing with slime time to time. Okay, I'm just gonna put the slime back into the egg. And apparently there's one more surprise. So she has this heart on her stomach and let's peel the sticker off. The reveal. And we have a dog house. So I guess that's it for this toy. Okay, one more. I wonder if it's like exactly the same thing, but with like cats. We'll see. Okay, the reveal. Three, two, one. Oh, it's so fluffy, I'm gonna die. Oh, she's so cute. I think I like this one better. Oh, we've got stickers, a collector's guide. Her name's Bubbles. Aww. So we've also got a slime. Same color and everything. So it's pretty much the same. And lastly, here's an egg. And, and we've got a little black kitty. A white kitty and a black kitty. She's a boo-boo chinchilla cat. And lastly, let's peel her stomach. And we've got a little mouse. It is a really cute fun touch. By the way guys, I always say this, after I'm done unboxing and I know that I'm not gonna use it again, I give everything away. Except for a few toys that I use to the core, I always give them away for free to kids. I give them away to my friends and family, teachers. They're not going to like a waste or anything, so please don't worry. Just saying, cause it's so important. Anyways, let's put these aside. Let's try this and call it a day. I'm going to unbox the other toys in a different video. So please comment below which one you guys really want to see. 
And this was what was inside. I have no clue how it works. So we've got like three tubes. I thought it would be more like a straw, but it's not. Some accessories, stickers, and an instruction sheet. So um, I guess it's quite simple. So here's the machine. You first put this inside the hole in the top and twist. I don't see anything yet. Oh, look, and it like turns into a spring. The handle's quite heavy, but like I've never seen anything like this before. This is why I love DIY toys. I know it's a toy, but it's a legit DIY kit. How far am I supposed to do this? Oh, I should have cut it first. Okay, I'm just gonna cut it off right here. And let's just do the rest. And there we have it. So we've got this springy thing, and apparently we could just pull this apart. Like so. One of my dreams in the future is to make my own DIY toy. That's why I'm not just like unboxing them for fun. I also unbox them for more experience. Anyways, you can use these to connect them together. So you slide it inside here on the other side. And when you close it, it turns into a circle. And um, I don't know what this is. I guess you can use this as like a necklace. Ooh, there's more parts. So you could put like a sticker onto these parts. Like let's try this one. And you could put this right here, like so. But you can change the length, the color, make it into keychains or accessories or anything that you want. For example, you can cut it shorter, connect them together to make like a hair tie. What else can you make? Oh, you can wrap it around your pen. So if you have like a pen or pencil, this is just an eyeliner, but you could kind of like wrap it around like so. I mean, that would be a cute pencil. If anyone asked me where I got this, I could be like, oh, I made it. Let's try the other colors. Let's try this pink one. This time I'm gonna cut it first. And twist. Is it done? A little bit more. And there we have it. Again, you could just like take them out. So here we've got two pink ones. And this time I'm going to get the blue and mix them together. So if you twist them together like so, it will look something like this. That's a pretty color. Okay, let me snip it off to make it the same length. Ooh. Oh, it matches my outfit today. And let me connect it together like so. Ooh, let's go with this sticker. I'm going to place this on top. And if I put this right here, and there we have a bracelet. So cute. There are just so many things you can do with this. I can't wait to use these in my future videos. So guys, I think that's it for today. Toys R Us is definitely a dreamland. So if you guys like this video, please give me a thumbs up and a comment below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next video. Bye.